I just have to say, it's freaking cold out here. We got some snow going on, accumulating, freezing our fingers, but I'm doing this because I want to show you this amazing neighborhood. So, let's check out the first destination. Custard tart. An egg custard tart. Only a dollar seventy-five. The thing that I love about this baker, um, you can see it kind of through, is how cheap everything is. A dollar, two dollars for all the items, and they're pretty good. They're very, obviously, they're very authentic. I mean, you you can see that they're like very traditional, um, very traditional bakery items and pastries from from somewhere. I'm, I'm not entirely sure actually. Um, I know that a lot of this area is Vietnamese, so I wouldn't be surprised if it was a Vietnamese bakery. Mmm. That's really good. Very cheap, very delicious. a little gift shop here on Argyle. The lady that ran the store, I asked her where most people are from in this area. She said that they're mostly from China, Vietnam, and there's some Filipino people here. She did not want to be on camera though, so you just have to take my word for it that that's what she said. This is a second story restaurant. Yeah. Brahma. Brahma? What do you guys serve here? Um, dim sum. Dim sum? Yeah, dim sum and regular Chinese entrees. What is dim sum? It's like a small portion of the body. Thank you. The hostess there said that this is a dim sum restaurant. And then when I asked her further about what dim sum is, she basically said it's like little portions of different things. So you get like a wide array, but just a little bit of food to try whatever cuisine that this is. I, I'm honestly not entirely sure. I'm not very cultured. I don't know the difference between Vietnamese, Chinese, Korean, Japanese food. Let's get on with it. I feel really awkward filming this in this random Vietnamese grocery store. Ah, yes, the ramen aisle, the food that sustains we college students, and Asian cuisine and culture is absolutely full of it. Like, seriously, I think there are over a hundred brands of ramen here. I'm really glad you came along with me to come see Asian Argyle, this amazing neighborhood, my favorite neighborhood in Chicago, maybe besides Rogers Park, which is my neighborhood. Whether you're a college student living in Chicago or a resident of Chicago or someone who's traveling to Chicago and you're looking for cool places to go, this is definitely a hidden gem of Chicago. It's one of those neighborhoods that doesn't get a lot of attention, but is jam packed with cool stores and food and culture and murals. And I think it deserves more attention than it gets. One of my favorite parts of shopping in this area and buying things here and just exploring this area is that it is really cheap. It's very cheap to go here. The food is relatively inexpensive. The grocery stores are cheap and all those little like trinkets, like I got this today at one of those little uh, gift shops and I think it was like $1.25. So if you get the time, hop on the red line, head on up or down to the Argyle stop to visit Asia on Argyle. Thanks for watching this video. I really appreciate it. And subscribe for more content with yours truly.